Hi everybody. So I'm gonna show you how to take off uh, fuel rail and fuel injectors for a 1999 Toyota Celica GT. Uh, so these are gonna be the sixth generation. Right now I don't see anything on the internet that really shows you how to take these fuel injectors off. So this is the easiest way I found. Okay. This is my car, six, six series, six generation. So here's what you're gonna have to do first. You're gonna have to take off your valve cover. It's not gonna work without taking off the valve cover. So, you're gonna, gonna pop all your spark plug wires. Then you're going to get a 30 millimeter. Take off all the four caps. These are the ones that are right outside the spark plug wires. You're going to take all those off. And this should pop right off. Where the wires are, with a wire harness on one side, you got to kind of move it, but it'll pop right off. Then you're going to need uh, 12 inch, I'm sorry, 12 millimeter to take the fuel rail off. So you're gonna have a 12 millimeter bolt here, 12 millimeter bolt here. You're gonna take those two 12s off and your fuel rail will come right off and with all your fuel injectors. And then you could change all your you can, well, you can clean your fuel injectors or change your injectors or change your o-rings whatever you got to do so after if you cannot if you don't take off this valve cover there's no way you can do it it's gonna be impossible so just make sure you take off your valve cover and after that you're gonna see how much room there is to do it after that okay, okay hope this helps everybody okay bye